Dear Future Love Story Producers, In 2013, I was diagnosed with bipolar, and the stigma of a mental illness kept me ashamed, silent, and suffering. At one point, I was downing medication with alcohol, hoping that I would just disappear. On sporadic moments of clarity, I would drive to the mountains and teach myself how to snowboard. While bruising from the falls, I would get up and do it again and again and again. While replaying Cry Wolf songs, Barry Now and Angel again and again and again. I'm facing back to front Over my shoulder at the sun And it's an open door And I've my line of sight once more One day, the depression was bad enough. I impulsively pitched Cry Wolf on his SoundCloud account. I simply, directly, and plainly told him the truth of what happened, what I was going through, why it's important he is involved. The interview was surreal. After having such an intimate relationship with his music for the past few years, I was in terrified bliss, sitting across from the artist responsible for carrying my pain with his art. There, he shared of his own struggles with bipolar. He told me that he was initially terrified of showing the world the truth of the lyrics he spoke life into from real and raw painful experiences. In his early years, he was making art he thought other people wanted to hear. After doing street art in anonymity, his creative experience revivified and he was emboldened to tap into his own truth. He told me that looking back at his early years, he should have just been doing what he loved doing all along. Little did we both know at the time that the Love Story Journal would be the first interactive artist-inspired journal designed for the breaking open of one's creative expression from heartbreak. We had an intimate conversation like one friend confiding to another, and that level of sharing both validated my walk as a crazy, creative, bipolar journal artist, and his personal story encouraged me to stay true to my own northern compass. May you one day share your face-to-face love story miracle. Love and blessings, Minji.